Hey guys, it's Keisha Noche from All World Create. Today is our fourth video from the series of body shapes. Today I want to share with you guys a few tips and tricks on how to dress the hourglass figure. So first and foremost, just like any other video from this series, you want to start off with your measurements. In order to know which shape you actually are from the five shapes, you want to measure yourself because measuring just helps you to know exactly where you fit. If you're unsure on how to go about measuring yourself, you can revisit my first video from this series of body shapes where I give a demonstration on how to properly do that. Now I've provided the link right here on the screen or in the description box below. Now after you have taken those measurements, you should have three markings. Your bust, your waist, and your hips. Now specifically for the hourglass, you will know if you are an hourglass figure if your ratio is roughly 4 to 4. And this means that your bust and your hips are proportionate and your waist is the smallest part of those three. Here are a few celebrity examples that have the hourglass shape. So the hourglass figure is the curviest of all the five shapes. It looks like I'm holding up Tam, but it's really five. I'm just using both my hands. Okay. And this gives you a really feminine figure that's easy to work with. That's a good thing. So for your body, you want to highlight your natural curves and or bring nice balance, both your bust and your hips at the same time to bring nice proportion. But most of all, you just want to flaunt your waist to show off those curves. So I do want to say this, that for the hourglass figure, there aren't many rules for you guys because your body is so well proportioned already, so you can basically do anything and make it look good. So I want to share with you guys a few clothing items that are sure to flatter your shape. So first I want to start off with shirts. For shirts, you can basically wear whatever you want to wear, whether that be peplum, loose, long, like, you can do it. But I will highly suggest wearing something that's form-fitting to your figure. Really because you want to show off your curves and your waistline. But on the other hand, wearing items too baggy isn't a nice compliment for your figure because it's not showing your curves. Next, I want to share with you guys a few tips for pants and bottoms. Pants, if you're looking to balance your bottom half, flared or wide leg pants work well because the wideness of your pants really balances out your hips. Also, skinny jeans, as you may already know, work really well for you because they really just bring nice definition to your curves. Another piece that really complements your figure are belts. Adding a belt to your outfit, if worn by the waist, really helps define that waist. Or if you put your belt around your hips as worn on low rise jeans, then it really helps to bring attention to your hips. And lastly, let's talk about dresses and skirts. If you're looking for a nice gown for, let's say, evening wear, a mermaid dress will do the work for you because mermaid dresses really just naturally go with the flow of the figure and define your natural curves. Fitted dresses also do the work with highlighting your curves. An empire waist dress brings a nice balance to your figure and it balances out your bust area and then gives a nice flow for your bottom half. It's a really classy silhouette. And for skirts, pencil skirts do really well for your figure because it really hugs the curves and defines your shape. And also high-waisted skirts are beautiful for your figure because it naturally draws the eye to the waistline, which is a part that you would definitely want to highlight for your figure. Lastly, I want to show you ladies how to pair a few of these items together to style as outfits. So here are three personally styled outfits that you can try. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give me a thumbs up and subscribe right below. 
And if you are an hourglass shape, comment below and let me know how this video has helped you. Now these were just a few tips, but trust me, there is so much more that you can do with your body. There's really no limits, it's all about having fun with it and just enjoying your body. And that's with whatever body shape you are. Learn to love it and work with what you have. Now next week I will be sharing a few tips and tricks on how to style the strawberry figure, otherwise called the inverted triangle. And next week will be our last video from the series of body shapes. So keep watch every Thursday for my latest video release on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube. So I thank you guys for watching this video and I'll see you next week. Thank you.